Let's try and fix the air conditioning on this Volkswagen Polo. It's been blowing hot air, there's been virtually no cold air coming out. So first thing I'm going to do is just switch the car on. Put the AC on and put it to maximum. Um, just open the bonnet. First thing we need to know is what sort of refrigerant the car is going to take. So just on the front of the bonnet underneath here, you can see there that it's got very clearly R134A. So that's the refrigerant that we need to um, use for the car. So I'm not really sure what's wrong with it. So the first thing we're going to do is locate the port where we need to check the pressure of the system. So here, just to the left, behind the water washer, you can see this big aluminum pipe, big thick one, with a little housing there. All we're going to do is unscrew that. And it's a bit like a tyre pressure port, and we're going to now just check the pressure in the system to decide what the next step is. My pressure gauge here that I bought, I think it was about 20 quid. Um, and if we take the other end, like I said, it's just like a bicycle pump really, just push that into this port here. Push it down, you'll hear a click. Let's see what the pressure is basically saying so okay that's not a good sign there is zero pressure in the system so that suggests that there's a leak in the system so the first thing we're going to do is put a leak cylinder in the system and then we'll put the gas in and repressurize so let's just take that off very easy on this particular one just push up and it comes off so there it is, a can of the stop leak. Again, I bought that off the internet. I think it's about 19 quid. Um, connected it to the dispensing unit. Um, we're going to have to clip that end back on, hold the can upside down, shake it until it's all empty, and then take it off. So I think it's pretty straightforward. Remember, the AC has to be on and to full power. So let's just clip this back on. down, there it goes, and then hold the cam upside down, press the engage, and let it all go through. What's interesting, the noise of the engine has changed us slightly. So the compressor unit has kicked in, so we need to get all of this gas out, it takes a while, but you can still feel it in there a little bit, Let's keep that emptying. gone in now and um, just take the end of the valve off here, pull it up. And now what we're going to do is put um, the gas in. So here's now the actual gas. It's a blue cylinder in this case so we're going to do exactly the same. Put the clip on, hold the can upside down, shake it, move it, shake it. Um, the can will go cold, then it'll start to warm up, and then we're just going to unclip the other end. So let's just put the other end back on. And then, very simple with this one, just push it down, and it goes. Stop.
start pushing. And let's just keep shaking that. Moving it. Move it side to side. It takes a bit of time, so I'm not going to film it all. Um, I'm just going to stop there. Okay, so the can's gone in. You'll feel it going cold, and then as it starts to empty, it goes warm. So the can's warm. The pressure is within the filled region. So this is a 500 grams equivalent can, which is what it takes. Again, it says that on the label, 500 grams. Let's take the end off, um, and then hopefully that should be it. Put the cap back on. Took off to start with, and then we can go back inside the car, and hopefully we'll be getting some cold air for once. Okay. I can tell you now that is absolutely fantastic. Real cold air coming out system, so that's done the trick. Very simple. I was trying to film it one-handed. Honestly, it's so easy to do. That could have taken, what, literally three minutes, four minutes to do. The thing is keep the air conditioning running at full pelt for at least five to ten minutes, just to make sure that the sealant and everything goes in and the gas is being circulated by the compressor. Um, and then turn it off and that's job done. So hopefully you found the video um, of some use. If you did, please subscribe. Um, thanks very much.